Hey guys, for this video, we're going to take a look at this app full 12 volt tire inflator. They were nice enough to send me this item for free so I can make a video showing it to you. So you can see right off the top, we have an LED light right there. There is a button off to the side. Obviously, it's not cordless, so it has to be plugged in to turn on the light. On the back side, we have a replacement fuse if we blow the fuse on it. We also have a couple different attachments for your, your floaties and your balls and different things. Also, this looks like it's some kind of a handle. I'm not sure why or what you'd handle, hang it from or whatever. There's a handle on the side, so that's there. On the bottom, we do have some rubber feet, keep it from knocking around so much. This little door hides your power cord, which is tucked up in this cavity here. So there's the 12 volt plug, plug into your vehicle. Also has a little Velcro strap to help manage it a little bit. And we do have a, a notch in the lid so that we can still shut it when the cable is out. Now if we look at the top, we can get the dog hair off. We do have a screen, that was my dog hair. Well not my dog hair, but my dog's hair. It didn't come with the package. Uh, and then we got four buttons. We got down, we got up, we got a power button and uh, some kind of a selector type button. And here is the hose that we hook up to our tire valve. And we got some pretty decent length. So let's get this out to the truck, see how it actually works, see how long that power cord is, and how this hose works with it. And I don't want to bury the lead on you either. It comes in this handy dandy zip up case so you can put it in your, your trunk or wherever you want. Got a little handle on top too. It's the bee's knees right there. First thing we're going to do is check out the cable length, see if we can get all the way to this back passenger tire. We can make it to the tire, but we're taking up every bit of what we got. Now the screen's not actually doing that. That's just camera goofiness. It's on solid, it's fine, don't worry about that. So it'll display the PSI that we're at. So let's just go ahead and thread this guy on. And you can see we aired it down to about 21 PSI. We want to bring that up to about 35. Also look how long the hose is. We'd be able to reach anywhere on the tire there if the valve stem was up at the top or something. So let's see, we want to go to 35 PSI. Now hit power. Well, I'd say that worked pretty well, eh? Now before we go, let's see what this LED light up here is all about. And that's what that's all about. There it is, guys. That's the app full. Thanks for watching.